And now, from Fox 55 News, this is your local sports. Hey, good evening, boys and girls. While the Comets sure decided now was a good, good time to start playing some of their best hockey of the season. In their last 11 games, the Kays are 8-3, and three, including a 6-3 and three mark here this month. That stretch has vaulted them into third in the Central Division with 71 points. Seven behind Toledo for second and three ahead of Kalamazoo for fourth. Tonight, the K is welcoming the Wings to town, trying to add to that small lead they already have. Let's head out to the Coliseum. This, the 11th meeting between the two teams this year. Kalamazoo had a 3-1 advantage after one. They added on to it at the start of the second. Man advantage, Tanner Sorensen, no from the blue line. Mike Neal there for the rebound. It's 4-1 Wings. Later in the period, Comets trying to make a game of this one. Sean Sidlowski to the streaking Brady Shaw. He's able to beat the goalie, his 24th, and the Comets pull within two. Then just under two minutes left in the second. Power play now for the Kays. Mason Baptista redirects the Sid one-timer into the back of the net to pull Fort Wayne within one. Be a 4-3 game after two, and that'd be all the scoring this one would see. Matisse Kivlinex with one of his seven third period saves. He had 25 of the night. Wings win it 4-3. They pull within a point of the Comets in the Central Division standings. These are the games tonight that you have to find a way to elevate, and, um, you know, we failed to do that. So, um, you know, I'm not content with our play at all. I, I think we got a lot of work to do still, and, um, you know, when it's these big games, uh, division games with teams that we're, we're struggling with in the standings, um, you know, we need to have players uh, be big-time players and, and show up and, and, and give a bigger, uh, you know, a bigger performance in games like these. We had some top guys that were invisible tonight, you know, and against these teams that are playing tight, defensive, checking games. Um, you have to play the game almost a playoff-style hockey. That's what we're in right now, and, you know, we got too many guys that are willing to do that. you got to get guys to raise their intensity level around here, I think. Uh, you know, if if uh, if you want to be a team that's going to win or go far in, in the playoffs in this league, uh, you know, you got to work for it every night and you got to be consistent. The K's are back home on Friday. Definitely some tough words from coach and the captain there. They'll host division-leading Cincinnati for an 8 p.m. puck drop.